iOS 18 now allows us to customize our iPhone's home screen like never before. And in this quick video tutorial, we're gonna go through a couple of customization options and show you what are these new features which Apple has added to its newest iOS update. So in order to start customizing your iPhone's home screen to your liking, you first want to long hold or long press on the empty space on your home screen until your icons start shaking and a little edit option will appear at the top left corner of our screen. We want to tap on this button and then customize. That will open our home screen editor where we have a couple of different options. Firstly, you can easily increase the size of your app icons by tapping on this large button and that will essentially make our app icons bigger on the home screen. And this can be useful if your eyesight isn't that good or you just want to see those icons more clearly. Making the icons larger will also remove the app labels or app names, which can give your home screen a more cleaner look if you're into those kinds of things. You will see four different options at the bottom, and that's all related to our icons. If you select this dark option, you will enable the dark mode for your app icons only, which is a new feature which iOS 18 brings to the table. I think that this dark mode for our apps looks interesting, but please leave a comment down below on what you think of this new look. Do you like it? Would you change something and similar? So you can enable the dark mode for the icons permanently, even when your device has the light mode enabled, or you can select this automatic option, which will enable dark mode for your icons only when the dark mode for the whole system is enabled. So keep that in mind. You can either set it to automatic, or if you want it permanently, tap on the dark option. But if you want a more colorful home screen on iOS 18, and you're interested in changing the app color and tint, then select this tinted button, which is all the way to the right. And that's gonna give us two different color sliders, which we will be able to customize. You can slide over the first slider at the top in order to select a color. And you can set this to literally any color you want. Maybe you want your apps to have a blue, yellow, green, red, or any other color. Just slide this and stop until you're satisfied. The second slider at the bottom will allow us to adjust the intensity of the color. If you want to make your color darker or brighter, you'll want to use the bottom slider. And I'll also show you a little trick with this second slider. If you don't like the new dark mode for your app icons, which I've showed you earlier in this video, but you want a dark look for your icons in order to get a sleek look, you just want to drag this second slider all the way to the right side where this white color is. And that will make all of your iPhone's icons black and white. And I think that this looks better than the dark mode. So you can customize these two sliders and achieve the color and tint which you want for your icons. So take your time here. I think that the black and white color for your icons looks pretty cool. So let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. And one more thing that you can now do with iOS 18 is to place your app icons anywhere on the home screen. You're not limited anymore with that grid that we had since the launch of iOS 1, but you will now be able to drag them and put them literally anywhere on the home screen, whether that's the top right, the center, the bottom, and so on. But yeah, those are some of the new customization features which Apple offers with the newest iOS 18 software update. You can now take your time, select the different colors and tint, Enable the dark mode if you want to, put your icons anywhere and so on. I have more iOS 18 tutorials, which I will put in the pinned comment in the description of this video. And you can check out how to lock your apps with Face ID, how to turn on eye tracking in order to control your iPhone with your eyes, totally hands-free, and many more new features. See you in another video everyone and enjoy!